Superintendent Richard Cristofaro from the Quincy Public Schools, and I'm Chief Paul Keenan. Uh, today, at the rear of North Quincy High School on Hunt Street, uh, there was a shooting. We received a report of a shooting. The shooting came in at uh, 3.33. The original call came in as a 911 cell phone call from uh, D'Angelo's reporting that a person had been shot. When the officers responded to the scene, they found a black male on the ground uh, across the street by uh, McDonald's, across the street from D'Angelo's. It was determined later on through investigation that there was a shooting uh, on the on Hunt Street uh, in the vicinity of North Quincy High School. There was an altercation between two male students. Uh, we believe that uh, after the altercation, or as a result of the altercation, the male, one of the male students that was involved, his brother pulled a handgun. We're not sure at this time what kind of a handgun it was. Pulled a handgun and shot uh, the victim. The victim is a 17-year-old male. He resides in Quincy. He's been taken to Boston Medical Center, and he is in uh, good condition with a gunshot leg to the upper thigh. Uh, after a brief, uh, brief uh, investigation, we determined that uh, the suspects may have fled to the house that's behind us here. It's on uh, East Quantum Street. A search was conducted with our uh, dogs, our canine unit, as well as uh, members of the state police, and we made a uh, four arrests as a result of that search in that house. The person that we believe that's responsible for the shooting is a Leon Perry. He's from Dorchester. He's a 19-year-old male. He was placed under arrest. He'll be charged in the morning with assault with intent to murder. We also have three other suspects that are under arrest. I don't have the names at this point in time. We're still following up on that. They'll be charged with accessory before the fact. These students is that, Chief? Is, is, is that? Uh, we're still looking into that. We don't know whether they're actually students. And so, did they take the 16-year-old, uh, the 17-year-old uh, victim? They take him outside, or did this argument just basically go from the cafeteria to the street? We believe that it started. Uh, we, it, it, the shooting actually occurred on the street, and he fled the scene across the street by the end. But I'm talking the original outside. argument. Happened. Exactly. I just want to. I want to make sure that that uh, commend the chief and the police for their immediate reaction to this. The security. Uh, within the high school, the teachers, the guidance people that really took charge and, and made sure that our students that were inside uh, were safe. Uh, there was a basketball game going on. Uh, they immediately locked down. Uh, so I want to commend those people that made sure our, our students were safe. And uh, we'll work with the families, we'll work with the police uh, in order to make sure uh, that our kids are safe uh, tomorrow and in the future. So so your reaction to this uh, incident that it's apparently started with an argument inside the school? Say that 